Loved ones in Sumner County say they have struggled to find the right words in the wake of seven murders there. But now comes their chance to help. News Force Forrest Sanders is in Springfield tonight with what's bringing loved ones all the way out there this evening, Forrest. So Tia Bailiff is an attorney here in Springfield. Uh, this is her office right here, but she is also the former pastor of that family. There's a meeting that's taking place in her office right now to discuss a possible benefit for that family. Many loved ones who are here tonight are saying it's just the best way to help. It's hard to sleep. Yep. But when we go home at night, it's there. Yeah, it's there. For years, John Poland and Haley Johns have been close friends of the Cummins and wholesale families. John has 20 years of memories, spending whole days traveling with these friends around Westmoreland, stopping at Young's Country Store, grabbing a bite at Kathy's cover. They were um, fun to be around. They were real close friends. Today, some of those old memories are hard. Saturday, Haley heard something was very wrong. She called the family. I finally got the aunt to answer, and all she said was, they're all dead, and I just lost it. Seven people were murdered, including John's close friends, Clara and David Cummins. John and Haley say what happened has shaken their Westmoreland community in a deeper way than anything before. It's like a nightmare, but you can't wake up from it. But there's hope help can come. The family's former pastor, Tia Bailiff, is holding a meeting right now at her Springfield Law Office. She's discussing possible benefits to help the surviving family. She hopes someone will donate a venue for one benefit and hopes to find a park to host an outdoor event to raise money as well. That this happens is important to John and Haley. They need love. That's, that's what they, need. they need love. That's what they need. So if you have a venue or just anything to donate, Tia says she's listening. Springfield and Forrest Sanders, News 4.